Hey, it's Andrew Brown and this fall along, we want to create some custom labels. It's pretty straightforward, but uh, I figured we should take a look at a more popular repo and see what kind of labels they're using, if they've even modified them at all. So we're over here on the Ruby on Rails um, uh, site and we can see we have lots of labels and they're breaking it down based on uh, sub packages and things like that. And I'm not sure what this is, it looks like maybe open issues. So you can go here and filter out to that. Um, there's a lot of automation that you can apply with labels. Um, so when you create issues, you could have labels being pre-assigned. You could have uh, pull requests act a certain way based on the labels it has. So there's a lot you can do with labels. We're not gonna show you all those automation features, but we will show you how to create your own labels, which is pretty straightforward. So we'll go into our fun repo and we'll go over to issues and we will create some labels. We'll make a new one here called um, secret, if we haven't already made one before, and I'll go ahead and just choose a random color, and boom, we have our secret label. If we go over to our issues, we can then go ahead and assign all sorts of labels. Super easy. So yeah, there you go. That's all you need to know. Ciao.